אז... היי גייז, זה מיטקו, האלרגיק ביקיפר. ואני ג'ן, הצ'יינס אמריקן. זאת מיני פנים, אם אתם מבינים. אתה צריך להיות ביקיפר. actually at the last farm in Campbell and the reason I'm here is because about three months ago I quit my career in commercial real estate right. Money isn't everything. Try to take it when you... and I knew nothing about bees but one of the people I met her name is Nikki and she owns the Mike and Nikki honey company she's a financial advisor and I found out when she was keeping bees that she was also looking for people to mentor and so I've actually been learning beekeeping from her and we're here at the last farm in Campbell where I learned to keep bees. I am fourth generation beekeeper. Six years ago, I moved to the Silicon Valley to pursue my software engineering career. However, I became a cybersecurity engineer. And meanwhile, I'm at the love of my life. Yeah, so you haven't quit your job yet. You still have uh, yeah, one okay. more week to go, right? Almost there. Everybody at the company has been very supportive and very excited about yeah. me and our future. Oh, that's so awesome. You know, a lot of people are saying, I wish I can do something like that. You know, like mm -hmm. go pursue my passions. Well, we are doing it. <laughs> right. Beekeeping started in my family over a hundred years ago. At my great grandparents' wedding, the newlyweds received their most valuable gift, a beehive. Everyone in the family line since was a beekeeper. That was not what I was about to be. Because <laughs> not to be. <laughs> I developed an allergy. Uh, young age, I've been stung many times and I haven't had abnormal reaction until I got a very severe one uh, where I was, I couldn't breathe. So, so why are you a beekeeper? <laughs> Yeah, so in the theme of weddings, we had our first wedding in March. We had three weddings on three continents. Married to the same guy, of course. <laughs> But um, yeah, the first wedding, Nitko's parents deeded us the farm that the family apiary is on. And we saw an opportunity to move to Bulgaria and bring Bulgarian honey to the world. Because really, Bulgaria has really great honey. And we'll talk more about that in a future episode. A week after the wedding, we went on this conference called the Investor Summit at Sea. And there is a guy who has coffee and cacao plantations over in Central America. And he has an amazing business. He's bringing sustainability environmentally and socially and just producing a really great product. And he has everything all vertically integrated. And we just got really inspired by his business. And we saw that. we could do something similar with our honey company. That's where the seed was planted. So Mitko's quitting his job next week. And right now our apartment's pretty much empty because we sold all of our furniture. So everything's on the floor right now. And we have two one-way tickets to Bulgaria in a month. Yeah, moving in with two suitcases <laughs> each. Yeah. Pretty much pack our lives. Oh. I'll bring a lot of those. Yes. Although we have them in Bulgaria too. Yeah. And so what you can expect is we're going to share with you what it's like when we move to Bulgaria. The first couple of weeks, we're going to be living around in different neighborhoods to find out where we should set up. Mm -hmm. Follow our journey. Hit the subscribe button below. Hit the bell so you can get notifications when new videos are posting. Yep. And follow us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. And go ahead and comment below. Is there something that you're passionate about that you want to go pursue? Anything, as crazy as it sounds, comment below. And stay tuned to find out about our trip to Panama to see the coffee and cacao plantations and our move to Bulgaria. Bye! Bye! Buzz. Buzz. I think I quit my job like two months after that conference. <laughs> and thank God I'm learning beekeeping in Campbell because it would be a lot harder to learn in Bulgarian. <laughs> Hit the, hit the subscribe button below. Do it again, do it again. Hit the subscribe. The one person just say the whole thing. Oh, one? Yeah. One person? You're making it complicated. <laughs> okay. The sun's setting. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're getting real dark here. Follow our journey. <laughs> okay. Right. Good job. Wait, you gotta say bye. Bye. Oh, yeah, oh. that's right. Bye. Bye.